Type 97 light armored car or Teke was a tank used by the Imperial Japanese Army in the Second Chino-Japanese War and in World War II. It was designed as a fast reconnaissance vehicle and was a replacement for the early Type 94 TK. The Type 97 replaced the Type 94 in 1939 and was designed as a light reconnaissance armored car. The Japanese also called it a armored car rather than a tank. Because the Teke was not meant for direct combat, it was assigned to reconnaissance regiments. Even though the Teke was produced from 1938 to 1944, only a total of 616 units were made. This Type 97 Teke was left behind by the Japanese army during World War II in 1944. It became part of the Indonesian army and the main gun was changed by a machine gun. In 1947 it was captured by the Dutch Marines on East Java during the Indonesian National Revolution. It was on display at the Dutch Army Museum in Delft, but it is now on display at Soest. In this short moment we are going to have a look on the disarmored plate here. We will notice that it has no armored plate above the tracks. The reason for this is it is the way to cool the engine. So on this side of the vehicle I noticed that it still had this original gold yellow paint job all hidden under this new paint job. And this is also why I love doing these videos because you start noticing small details like this and you start to see a story unfold in front of your eyes. ま、Notice that some lucky souvenir hunter took the brass star from the front of this vehicle. You can still see the fitting that would hold the Imperial Japanese Army brass star to the front.
っぱ当たり見る諸国日本のつわものどものたくましい姿に打ち振る日照期もちぎれんばかり迎えるもの迎えられるもの敵アメリカを迎えて決戦はまさに始まった焦る敵アメリカは陸の決戦場をフィリピンに求めんとするか来たらば来たれ我が方の備えは万全フィリピンの山野に戦車部隊を中心とする撃滅の機動訓練はあらゆる敵の作動を封じ去るであろう。